Okay, we're in Hawaii. <laughs> we got the Jeep. It's pretty cool, Here's Sophia. We got the food. And we came and got some tin, what's it called? Roof. Tin roof. Oh my God, garlic shrimp. <laughs> we got some mac and cheese. No, mac salad. Oh, I'm sorry, mac salad. And I got the pork belly. Ooh la la. Oh my God. <laughs> uh, fucking delicious. I can't wait to eat. All right, we're gonna eat real quick. <laughs> See you guys. 121. Let's check it out. Hey. So you walk in, there's a little closet right there. Little paintings. The fridge. The kitchenette looks pretty nice. Pretty awesome. Has everything you need. Stove, microwave, dishwasher. Then to the left right here is the bathroom. Super nice. Has a full on shower. It looks pretty awesome. And then a little closet right here. Yo. Comes with some hangers, some chairs, other fun beach stuff. So let's continue on. Saw the kitchen. Into the main room. You can see Sophia in the background. King size bed. We got a little table, couch, TV, and then obviously the best part probably we have a little say hi <laughs> we got a little patio that's to the grass and it's kind of hard to see from here but all the way in the back there's the beach and if you actually look in a little closer right there you can see there's three cabanas those are private for all the residents here from nine to five they provide beach chairs and stuff and it's like your own private little beach so it's super dope we're gonna probably wake up have breakfast there tomorrow or something we got a little table here too. View from but uh, yeah, we're here. Ready to have some fun. I can't wait. I think now we're probably just gonna nap. <laughs> See ya. Morning. <laughs> <laughs> All right, 605 right now. About to head out, get picked up for the road to Hana Tour. Uh I'm all dressed and ready to go. You got a on. So Sophia? I'm we're just waiting now to head out. Hello. Let's get out of the road. Get out of the road. Ah, let's get out of the road. <laughs> yeah, it's so green. It is beautiful. This is one of the first waterfalls I think we're going to, right? It, it is the first one. And then we're also going to end here. Oh yeah, and then we can go swimming later. Uh -huh. Which, that'll be cool. We'll definitely do some swimming. Uh, the view is beautiful. Oh, I think I see Ooh, it already. I see it. Whoa. So pretty. <laughs> it looks beautiful. And we can swim in there. That's awesome. So we just saw the big waterfall. Now we're gonna look at the little one. If we're not gonna get into just yet. Maybe for toes? But maybe later. Oh, I guess if you want to. Whoa. We're definitely gonna swim in this later. That's so cool.
butterfly. Okay, we just finished our swimming at Black Sand Beach. We're ready to go now. We're gonna go meet up our tour bus. But I will film a little bit on the way home or on the way to the bus so you guys can see. And look, there's a little kitty that came and hanging out with us. I said so, it jerky. Sophia kept giving it jerky. <laughs> it liked it. I did like it. Okay, let's go. Look at all these kitties. It's a little house right there. People live there apparently. And then the ocean. We'll get a better view of it coming up. This is the walk back to the parking lot. You see there's this little bridge. You see behind us, all the way over there is where we came from. You go part of this house that way, there's stairs to go down to the beach. I filmed a little bit down there, so hopefully you guys will be able to see. But here's where the nicer views are. Or not nicer, I think it's the best down there. At least that's what our tour guide said. Let's get a little bit of... Look at that. It's pretty cool. Cemetery. Oh yeah, these rock formations are actually cemeteries. So they say don't always walk on the sidewalk because if you don't, you might be walking on someone's grave and people get really mad. Look at that view. Pretty cool. Hopefully we'll be there right on time. Apparently there's a blowhole here as well, but the waves weren't strong enough for it to work. Pretty cool, you can even see people on that cliff. What's up guys? We're on our last stop before we head home. We're at this beautiful beach, but this is one of the sights inside. Look at the mountains, the grass. This way you can see the beach. We're gonna go closer and give a better look. <laughs> Not yet. All right, this is the beach guys. Look at that. Hey, gonna see a bunch of turtles now. But look at all these people surfing. They do. There's so many. Look at all this they can roam. Look at all those chickens. And <laughs> cows. Those chickens. Turn around from our view from our living room. They're all the way basically just straight ahead. They're like right there. Um, and then there's the beach. So we could walk it, but we kind of have to walk around. I don't know if you guys can tell, but over the bush, there's like a golf course and you have to kind of walk around it to like around these all these buildings that are right here towards our left so we can actually call the front desk and they're going to come pick us up in like a golf cart which is kind of cool and yeah it's private for the tenants here they kind of i think they supply you with chairs and towels and stuff so it's pretty fun i'm gonna put on some sunscreen and go yep. We got our own private beach.
And we get a ride here. Swam a little bit. Doing pretty good. Now we're just chilling. Waiting for the uh what's it called? The golf cart guy. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> We had a hank. Oh, look, it's a cocoon. Cocoon. Of what? We don't know. Anyways, <laughs> we had a sudden craving for onigiris, musubis, and anything that you can get at 7 Eleven. And the only 7 Eleven is 45 minutes away. So we're going to 7 Eleven. <laughs> Eddie is our driver. So I am the navigator. Let's do this for the musubis. Check out the view. Hey. Kind of reminds me of PCH. Kind of. Look at those blue waters. They're see-through. We've <laughs> been in them. We can tell you. Oh my god, 40 minutes. <laughs> but now we're here. But don't tell the locals. Let's go, let's go check the food. It's, it's weird that we did this. <laughs> Eddie, how much did we just spend at 7-Eleven? So we spent like 60 bucks at 7-Eleven. <laughs> I think it was worth it. But yeah, I bought I got a vape, so that was like 20 bucks. But the rest was all on food. Okay, you also got alcohol. Oh shit, I forgot I got alcohol. Okay, my bad. <laughs> the food was not that expensive. They had a bunch of masubis. They had uh, sushi. They also had a lot of bento boxes, which I wish I could have gotten, but but I think I got enough food already. I got like three rolls. <laughs> yeah, you would have probably put down a roll or two, maybe. The yeah, rolls were like a dollar. Okay. Anyways, this is what some of the rolls look like when they come. It's not cut up or anything. You just wrap it in the seaweed and then you eat it whole. I also got a pickle, so that's pretty cool. Ooh, they also had like a bunch of warm food too. Very different from what we have at, in the uh, mainland. They called it a luck chul. I think that's Filipino. Oh. Or, hold this. It might just mean Chinese sausage, which is like in Vietnamese, lak sung. Which I think it is. Ooh. It's steaming. Oh my god. Do we do you wanna eat it here? Yeah, why not? Let's do it. Smell it. Oh my god. It, it smells like, good. Looks like a Chinese sausage wrapped in like a regular bao bun. And that's exactly what it is. Really? <laughs> I'll try a bite of it. It's salty. Mmm. Oh, thank you. <laughs> All right, well, we're gonna eat, and we'll, and we'll be right back. Tada! <gasps> we're so far away. <laughs> Finally got to the base of the mountain. It's nice and pitch black out. 
but we have a buddy in front of us, so that mm -hmm. makes us feel better. It is four in the morning. And we're about, what, less than an hour away. We're 56 minutes away. Sunrise is scheduled for 6 a.m., probably 6, 6.30. Ah. <laughs> it's nothing but dirt. Wait, that was my face. <laughs> <laughs> You've heard of deer crossing, but have you heard of cow crossing? So it says the next four miles, you might encounter some cows. We've probably seen at least 15 so far. But they're just sleeping by the side of the road. But yeah, you kind of have to look out. Oh, I think I just saw a few more. Really? Yeah, on the, on the top. We are. This is sign that says Haleakala. It still says we have another 26 minutes, but there's a little booth here. Proceed, pay fees ahead with credit card. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Good. All right. What is the last name on the reservation? Valdivia. V-A-L. V-A-L. Yes. Yeah. Now, is anyone traveling with a national park pass? No. Okay, anyone in the car, U.S. military or veteran, or have a permanent disability? No. Okay, so it's going to be a $30 entry fee. Okay. Well, she was nice. She was so nice. <laughs> so she said 11 miles to go. We're going to end at the very top. And beware of birds. Time's right now about 5.45. Waiting for it. Can you see us? Ah, you can, I can. Hey, we're all bundled up. It's so crazy. <laughs> it's really cold. It's windy, that's what it is. Because I have it super wide. Eddie signing off. <laughs> I'm gonna stay recording until we get it.
Touching Maui. <laughs> 